Hello everyone and welcome to this channel. In this video, I am going to show you on how to create a login credentials using environment variables. Meaning to say, no need to input the database password because we will let the database look up the current username of our computers. By the way, environment variables, this refers to the computer name, the current username that being logged in, and also the computer specs. So to give you an idea guys, let me show you my sample. This one, uh, this is my sample database. As you can see, upon login, there's a message you are not registered in this database. Contact your administrator for access permission. So we cannot, we cannot access this because when we click OK, automatic close. So it happens because uh, the current user, this one, is not yet uh, registered in this database. Not yet registered here so let's put user okay close and then we'll come page it's open again okay so there's nothing happen there's no message and we can continue to work let us try to delete this and close again and then open again okay because we have deleted the user so, how to do this? If you are still interested, please watch this video until the end and please subscribe if you have not yet. Subscribe. <laughs>
So let's type uh, me that current username. Then what will happen? There's a message. The message would be you are not registered in this. Okay, in this database. And then let's put some space. Wait, what will happen? Sorry. Okay. Contact. Or access permission. And BB critical. Okay. And F. So let's try, guys. So when we open this, invalid the use of null. Let's debug. It's normal, guys. So, the error is this one. They look up invalid use of null meaning to see. So, those um, user is not yet uh, recorded in the tables, uh, user tables account. So, or user accounts table. Sorry. So, to avoid that error, we'll, we will use the nz function. So let's put nz. And here, let's put 0. Or... Yeah, zero and that one. So, okay. Yes. Again, open. Okay. So, you are not registered in this database. Contact your administrator for access permission. Let's try again, guys. Let's put some space. Here, BBC uh, CRLF. Okay, that one. And then, if they are not the same, so do CMD that close so that they cannot proceed. You are not registered in this database, so there's a space and then contact your administrator for access permission. Upon click, OK, the database will be closed. Charang, OK. And we can hide this. No. OK. Open again. OK. So now let us try to put the uh, username. This one. Let's add her a user. Okay. Close. And open. Okay. Okay, what? Let us add. Uh, let us. No. Okay. Okay. So, it's working, guys. So, I think this is enough. If you want to know more about uh, making about Microsoft Access Database then guys please consider subscribing this channel and also please click the bell button so that you will be notified uh, about my incoming videos and also if you have some questions just comment it down below I will try my best to answer it so thank you and see you to my next video